vandalized, stolen, even torched. One New Mexico city is dealing with a rash of attacks on its fleet of trucks. The cost of all that damage is adding up quickly, and the culprits have not been caught. News 13's Amanda Goodman reports. In three months, a third of Boleyn city owned pickup trucks have been taken out. It ended up being a total loss. That we're talking $16,000 for that one. The city has 32 trucks that workers use as part of their jobs. Since October, seven have been vandalized or burglarized, and three were flat out stolen. Still under investigation, and we're trying to determine if they are uh, the different situations are related to each other. Police also aren't sure what's behind the vandalism and thefts. The trucks that were stolen all eventually turned up. One can be repaired. The other two, one was torched and another had the engine taken out, are total losses. All that costs taxpayer money and from our budget, which uh, we probably won't foresee hiring any people soon because of a lot of this. The city says the trucks were all in secured city department parking lots. One was even in a garage, but the crooks still managed to get in. They damaged two of the fences to get to these vehicles, and they damaged one of the doors to get a uh, garage door to get to this vehicle. Now the city is allowing some on-call workers to take their trucks home because they think they might be safer there. It's also doing more to protect its department's parking lots. So our cameras, instead of facing the entry gate, they're facing the vehicles now. And in one area department, we up the lighting. In Belen, Amanda Goodman, KRQE News 13. The city says its insurance premiums are going to skyrocket because of the thefts and vandalism. Police are looking for anyone with information and asking them to contact the police department.